Danielle, good morning to you. This is really the result of international reckoning within the Catholic Church hitting right here at home. After months of investigations, that list of names, credible sexual abusers within the church set to be released. We understand that list will include priests, clergy, and other, other members of the church leadership. The number of names is expected to be in the dozens. The diocese says it will also include, quote, other pertinent information. It is unclear how far back the list will go, but Eyewitness News has been following these developments for months. In December, Bishop Thomas Tobin announcing on Newsmakers the publication of the list sometime in 2019. At that time, saying the church is committed to providing the list of names to the Attorney General's office. I think the important thing to emphasize is that we report everything comes in, even if we don't think it's credible. I don't think there will be too many surprises because they've already been publicized. This announcement comes just days after Rhode Island state lawmakers uh, passed a bill expanding the statute of limitation for sexual assault cases, moving it from seven years to 35 years. We are expecting this announcement sometime within the next hour at around 8 o'clock. As soon as we get it, we'll be sure to keep you posted at WPRI.com and, of course, throughout this broadcast. Live in Providence, Brandon Truitt, Eyewitness News.